Here you are today, right one auto sales, looking at a 2014 Jeep Cherokee. Gonna first come around here, check out these tires, looking for the tread, the tread looks good. Just gonna back out now, you will see one small scuff up here in the front. Just continue around the rest of this exterior, just gonna look at any extra features. You're gonna have nice black alloy wheels down there for you. As you come around the back, you will see that this is gonna be the limited four wheel drive. You will have some towing assist back here for you as well. We have a nice rack up there also. As we're finishing up here, we're just gonna back out now and go check out your interior. Starting out here on your driver's side, you're first gonna be able to come down and see that you're gonna have fully powered locks and windows here for you. You will see that you're gonna have two presets here for your seat. Your seats are also gonna be fully powered and have nice soft black leather interior here. You can come in here, check out your mileage. You will see it's going to have 64,866 on the dash. You're going to have a couple of other displays up there, like gas usage and mileage. You will see that you're going to have some temperature display up there along with your time. You can come over here, look at your display area here in the middle. This is going to be where you see your backup camera display. You can come in and see that you are going to have a nice navigational system here for you. You do have some other controls like climate up here as well. As you can see there, you can connect your phone up into this as well. For your audio options, you're going to be able to have AM, FM, and satellite radio. Bluetooth is also available along with auxiliary. As we come down here, your climate control is going to be just below. You can come down here and see also that you're going to have an additional power port along with USB, auxiliary, and SD. Before we back all the way out, I will come and show you that you're going to have multiple different driving options here, different driving modes. You will come to your middle console area. It will be a two-level console area. It does go deeper down also. You will also have an additional power port in there as well. Coming into your back seat here, just checking out these seats, looking for any damages as we're going through here. Everything's looking good. Not going to see any stains or anything. Floors also look good. Very well kept up down there for you if you can see them. There it is. You will see that you're going to have some climbing, a little bit of climate control for your backseat passengers. You will also have heated seats back here along with additional outlet and USB ports. Coming into your cargo area here, you're going to see that you are going to have a nice weatherproof mat there for you. You are going to have a power trunk also. You can lift this up bring this up you will see that you're going to have your basic spare in here you are going to also have some additional storage spaces there to the left and right coming into your back seat here once again from the passenger side just give you another view here from another angle once again everything is very nice and clean back here you can also bring this down and see you can have an adjustable armrest and cup holder there for you i was finishing up here on the passenger side i will let you notice that you are going to have this nice dark brown wood grain going across the whole car you will have fully powered seats over here on the passenger side as well and give you a nice look at this passenger seat everything is nice and clean over here you can look up and see that you're gonna have a nice sunroof provided in here for you just gonna come down now just give you a nice driver's eye view here as we've gone around everything has looked very nice and clean haven't really seen any damages very nice features as we come back up here to the front and as we're backing out this is gonna wrap up i'll walk around